Hi there, this video is intended for adults who like to craft. Hi guys, Linda here and Sophie. Um, someone asked how I painted rocks and I thought I'd show you a few that I painted. These I did all when I was up north last summer and um, I've been doing a lot of walking and I noticed people are stopping and putting rocks around. So. I got a couple more here I want to paint and put around if my kitty cat will let me. Come here. So. Oh. All right. So, I have some nice flat rocks. And these, some of these are from my friend up north because the river up north has really nice um, rocks, nice flat rocks. All right. So, first thing I'm going to do is take some white paint and go over them. I think I'm gonna do somewhere like this. This one says on, I wrote something on the back, it says laugh, it's good for your abs, and I thought that was kind of funny. So I'll start with some white paint. I don't do a lot of prep to them, but at the end I um, put, um, you know, I spray them with some spray to help them stay. Let me see. I don't know, I just, grab brushes it doesn't really <laughs> matter to me and it, this has got water in it this is really for your fingernails but or something I don't know but I like using it for painting and stuff all right so oh this is really a dumb brush I don't know if I'll use this but we'll see so up north I really have limited stuff that I can use um, I was trying to paint some with my granddaughter when she came to visit and all the paint I had, I had left up there all winter and it froze and it turned to like a gel. And no matter what I did, it wouldn't um, go back. So it was weird. So I'm just gonna kind of give them a little white brush just to, oh, that's a cool one. Kind of red. The friend that sent me the rocks, I went rocking with her and she knows all the rocks and it's just so cool. Her name is Susan. Hi Susan. I don't think Susan watches my videos. So she lives up north year round. Sophie, so what are you doing over there? All right, so now I gotta decide. I kinda like these faces just to make a quick face. This one should be better this way. Um, I think what I'll do is take them over and dry them real quick. I just took my embossing um, dryer thing and dried the paint on them a little bit. Sometimes I sketch the face on and then paint it and other times I just freehand it but I think I'll sketch them on. Um, Susan sent me a sheet of paper with a whole bunch of faces like these that are really cute. Um, let's see. For me it's the simpler the better. Oh, I, I think he's pretty cute. Maybe we'll try that one uh, on this longer one. Okay, so I'm just going to kind of sketch his eyes on here. And then, um, oh, he's got a big round nose. And then he's got an O face, an O mouth. And then he's got big bushy eyebrows, so big commas. All right, so that part would be black. This has to be whiter. Um, let's see, I do have a red pen out here, but I think we'll just do this one in black and white. The white is usually the harder Thing to do so I'll just take some straight white 
and a brush. What happens is, you know, it's so coarse. I probably should treat the rocks first or something. I don't know. Gesso? I don't know. Um, <clears throat> and then maybe, you know, the paint would go on better. This one's going to be really quick, which is nice because I'm just going to leave them on the path. And, you know, I don't want it to be a, like, great work of art that <laughs> I don't want to give away. I don't like any of my art's great works of art, but it's still kind of fun. All right, so then I think this is a, it says a black oil, so I don't know if that's going to work or not, but we'll see. Oh, it's kind of thick. Um, so, oh. I wish it was a little thinner now for this part. I think I'll let those dry just a little bit more. Yeah, so I, I mean, I don't make this hard. I just do a little bit. <laughs> and then, then I'll spray them with a, I don't know, polyurethane or something that I'll, Fix it. I know when I was up north, I asked the guy up there what was the best thing to spray on it. Oh, maybe, maybe this pen would work good. It's not very pointy at all. Oh yeah, it's working just fine. All right. So then he's got. A little bit different eyes. The smaller pen. I think we can do it with this. So he's got a little bit open up here. So like that. Alright, and then the same thing over here. Gotta give them in frame. Let's see, am I in frame? So there's one. That was pretty easy, wasn't it? Oh, let's see. I should have done it with this marker. Make his nose a little fatter here. Um, yeah, so then, you know, I'll spray him. But on the back, I do want to put this on there because I just think it's funny. I think I'll do it with this pen because you can still see it. So it says laugh. Good. Or your abs There you go. Well, there's one little guy done. Let's do another one. I want to do one like this because I, I like this guy. I think he, I like that he has the teeth and stuff. So this will be a little bit more work. Um, but that's okay. But it appears, I hope you can see, like my hand's probably totally in the way. So then the tricky part's coming down far enough. So you can get lips and teeth and all kinds of, or tongue and teeth in there. And then what I do is I just go like this and then paint the teeth in and then put the, the lines in it. So all of this is going to be black. And maybe I'll take this and fill it in with this one. Maybe. So these are, this is a paint pen, 
up north I, I don't have all these pens with me so I just paint with a little brush but okay now I want to make its lips and I have a red paint pen so we'll try that nope we got a little water on there somehow so is that yours Yeah, you know, Sophie's shaking his head, her head, and yeah, this is one that gets messy, Sophie. Okay, we'll let that dry and see what happens, okay? <laughs> I don't know if you can see her, but she's right here. Okay, can you just move up just a little bit? Oh, that's a good girl. All right, you want to lay on the paper. Okay. So it, yesterday was so beautiful here. I went for a three mile walk and then the girl downstairs wanted me, wanted to know if I wanted to go for a bike ride. So we ended up going for a, a long bike ride, well, a 13 mile bike ride. It wasn't so long, it was only an hour, but we both have um, e-bikes. So 13 miles is very doable. All right, I gotta fix this white now. I'm gonna have to take it over and dry it. Take it all the way down there. As you see, this is when it gets tricky when you make mistakes. All right, so I think I got that on there okay. Um, I am going to need to refix this a little bit. put the teeth in and I find it easier to start with this one. So we got some teeth. Gotta make sure they connect and then kind of put a little a little bit you know so that the tooth is kind of rounded. Alright, so I'm happy with that. So then I want to put a big old nose here. <laughs> That's a big nose. Okay, and then some eyes. And then some eyebrows. Yes. I like this one better because I like the way, um, you know, it's not real white. And I could change that by just going over it with a little bit of water, I think. Take off some of that white. i got to be careful with the um, marker. He might need a little bit of blush, too. Then when I spray them, sometimes that changes them, too. All right, I think I'm going to put a little bit of rouge on here and get a light rouge. some of these colors in here. This is kind of a light pink. Still not real happy with this white. The lines, the brush. 
fresh lines. Take some of those out of there. Sometimes I fuss and fuss and fuss with them. And then sometimes if I don't like them at all, I just paint over the whole thing again and be done with it. But I'm going to call him done because I can, um, you know, like I said, I'm just going to leave them on the sidewalk. And that might make someone's day. All right, so again, we're going to put... I put I should put good for your soul because it is good for your soul too to laugh. Okay, and here's another one. Now we got one more to do. Um could do a gnome. Um Like a garden gnome. I just won't put the snowflake on it. I think I'm going to put the white on there first. Probably should have done that. Well... All right, so we're gonna put the colors in before we put the, let's see, maybe I'll give them a different color hat because then it would be a little bit better. Okay, small brush. these whiskers in here. Gosh, all you artists out there are probably watching me paint going, oh, that girl needs some painting lessons. I just try to do what I see. <laughs> Shapes that I see, I guess, is what I should say. And If that's the way you're supposed to do it, I don't know. I mean, I haven't, I've had a, like a few lessons maybe from a friend, but nah, not really, nothing more than that.
beige color. Gotta let that dry. Gotta get a color for the hat. Pink hat. Oh, this is really a fine one. That's right. It'd be harder to fill it in, but that's okay. Let's see. Come, Sophie. She's probably not going to stay because this paint is stinky. like using this. So we're gonna paint this in and leave a little spot for the white. I know I'm mumbling, aren't I? I'm sorry. I do that when I'm concentrating. Okay, so Kind of like whiskers. It's not looking too good, but oh well. He's got a wild whiskers, this guy does. Almost like wings. something there maybe a red heart and I gotta put some white in his eyes and gotta paint his nose um, go around the heart well we'll let that dry a little bit um white in his eyes I do have a bunch of those little things for making uh, dots, but I don't know where they are right now. So we'll try this.
Well, I think that'll make somebody smile, and we'll just put the word smile on the back. Let's see what we can do it with. Smile. Maybe I'll put my initials. All right, there's one I'm going to put on the road. I'll put my initials. This one. This one I'm not real happy with because it's too white. But so these are the three that I keep for, um, you know, <laughs> ideas. I'm thinking he needs something else. Um, what else could we do? What is my. Oh, well, I could put a few little lines here. Let's see, do I want the lines to go out like this? Or I, I think I want them to go out like this. He's got to have a few um, wrinkles, right? Yeah, that makes, that's better. All right, and this guy, oh, I don't know what to do with you. Um, let's see, we've got a border around. I think you're just good. That'll be good. So today when I go for my walk, I'll take, I'll go spray these quick outside and then I'll take them for my walk and leave them in different places because I wanted to do that. Anyway, have a great day. Hope you're enjoying the, hope you're having good weather and able to enjoy it. I know I am. Thanks for watching everybody. Stay healthy. Bye.